Hey guys, welcome to this video. I've been getting a lot of emails from people on YouTube asking me how to hide a drive in Windows 7. Now what I mean by that is let's go up to my computer and uh, these are my drives and basically we want to hide say drive D. Okay, So we'll go inside here and um, as you can see I've got this stuff inside my drive. Okay, So as you can see there's full of stuff in there and I want to hide this drive. So what I'm going to do is right click on my computer or computer, go to manage, this will open up a box, computer management and then we can come straight down to disk management and you just click on that. Now I've seen a lot of people saying that you need to um, edit the registry and stuff like that. You don't really need to do that really. So this is the drive where you're going to hide, okay? So what we're going to do is click on this drive, right click, change drive letters and paths, click on that, okay I'm going to remove this like so and it will come up and say some programs that rely on this drive blah 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 okay and we're just going to delete that now, okay? That's drive D Let that do its thing. As you can see the drive letter is now gone. So if I just push this down here and go back to there you go. The drive has now disappeared. Okay. Now the data is still there and you can't see that drive unless you come into this area here. Okay. You will be able to see it, but it's not been allocated um, a letter as such. But the drive is now hidden as you can see. So all we need to do if we want to put it back is we're just going to right click on this again change drive letters and paths and then all we need to do is add okay assign the following drive letter D click OK and they press though back she comes again so let's have a little look you can see the D now is uh, turned up there and uh, we'll have a look, look there and you can see drive D and all my data is still in there okay so you don't need to hack the registry and start doing stuff like that I've seen a lot of people saying you need to do that you don't need to do it that's all you need to do okay so you've seen it here first my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk hope you enjoy my videos if you do enjoy my videos please remember hit the subscribe button and show your support and uh, if you haven't been over the forums yet then head over to there and uh, register on there for free got any computer problems I'll do my best to help you over there there's a couple of good guys over there helping out and you'll see the address at the bottom of the screen so thanks again for watching guys thanks for your support bye for now